Okay, it's a little overwhelming. Just have to take it one day at a time. This is uh, wallpaper in the hallway that is coming off pretty easily. You can just kind of rip it. And it's like Russian nesting dolls. I take a layer off and there's another layer of wallpaper on the back. Funny, um, I kind of like that wallpaper better than the floral. It's weird, it makes me wonder about fashion, you know. Why do things, I mean, because this geometric kind of stuff is more in style these days, and this teal color is too, although it's pretty faded now, but I don't know, like why do we like things at certain times and then we change? Like in 10 years, are these soft florals gonna come back? I don't know. Anyway, it's all coming down and I'm just gonna do solid colors. I can philosophize about this some other time. Uh, let's see a couple of comments. Um, I have always wanted one of these uh, window stickers and I went and got one today. So I, I need to like trim the edges. It's still kind of messy right now, but it's so cute. Um, I needed to put it on because this window like looks directly into the neighbor's living room and there's just like a direct eye shot there. <laughs> um, so let's just have some privacy. That'll be good. Also, I saw this thing at the um, hardware store. It was only $5 and I just had to get it and try it out just to see. So look at this. Okay, so you just screw it on. Can you see that? It's lighting up. There's like rainbow light. <laughs> it's water activated. Um, I'm a little disappointed because the picture shows like rainbow water. Um, and it's not actually, it's just a light. But still, that's really cool. The light comes on when you turn the water on. So I am grateful for that. I'm trying to count my blessings because I am really tired. I haven't been sleeping very well. And um, it's probably because I'm just stressed out and it's in a new place and just lost a lot of sleep. And then, of course, that's like triggering my headaches. So have to stay positive. Um, things will improve. Um, okay, so kitchen. I am having less luck with the kitchen wallpaper. It's really sticking on there. I can't scrape it off. I mean, there are parts where I can get something like this part sticking out and I can feel it. But then like other parts just really, like I worked on this with a scraper for a really long time and couldn't get it off. Um, I did the internet trick where you spray it with vinegar, let it sit and then like try to scrape it and that didn't do it. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, started taking off these tiles and lo and behold, they're not actually tiles. These are, metal plates that go over whatever this is, like ugh, pressed particle board. Weird, I don't know, I don't know what it is. It must have been some sort of thing in the 50s where you could get like cheaper tile. I don't know. I need to figure out how to take this stuff off because it's ugly and it needs to come down. Um, I got a whole bunch of paint today. So I'm eager to start painting. I actually did start painting a little bit in the living room. Um, that's what this is all about. I went to a lot of work to tape and then I got tired and I was like, I'm just gonna paint really slowly and I won't bump the edges. Famous last words. <laughs> um, the vision that I have for the house is, um, it's covered with this, or not covered, but it has this color trim all over. The windows and the baseboards are all this color. Um, and I think it's a really beautiful wood. It's like a golden color. It needs to be polished a little bit. Um, and it'll really glow, I think, given a little bit of TLC. So I want to really bring out that wood. So I'm doing darker colors around it so that it can kind of shine. Um, that's my goal. We'll see if I'm successful. This is, uh, so I'm putting a gray in the living room. Um, as you can tell, obviously not done. This is weird because whoever painted in here before painted over 
other wallpaper and I didn't figure that out until I was like, I don't know, I'd already done like an hour's worth of painting. I heard this sort of crackling sound and I'm like, is that paper? And then um, I removed this baseboard over here and sure enough, there's wallpaper. I'm not really sure what I should do. Like, is it bad if I just paint over it? Like, I don't know, should I take the wallpaper off? Really not sure. Um, that's really all that I've been able to get done today. I also worked today, so it wasn't uh, fully, you know, working all day. Um, another thing I'm grateful for is this herbalism class that I took because I learned uh, that healing plants are all around us. And um, I thought, uh, you know, I'm sort of in pain with these headaches starting to kick in and I've been having trouble sleeping and oh duh, I know a plant that can help both of those things. It's called wild prickly lettuce. I know what it looks like and it grows everywhere everywhere. So I went out to the yard and I found a wild prickly lettuce plant and um, made some tea. So in a couple hours when it's time for bed, I'll take some of this and hopefully it'll knock me out and help me sleep because that's what I really need. I just really need to feel better. Um, well, one more thing. I got a microwave at ReStore, which is a used construction supply store. Um, so this is an um, microwave that you mount on the wall above a stove it has built-in charcoal filter so you don't need the range hood so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move the stove over here and put the microwave above it um, however when I got it home uh, it smells like cigarette smoke um, so ick I'm gonna have to really spray it with vinegar and take out the filter replace it with a new filter and just try to get it Smelling like new. Okay, so, oh, oh, and I ordered flooring today. It's gonna come in one to two weeks. That's the progress.